guys, and welcome back to another episode of Terraria. So, at long last, I finally decided that I think today is the day that we go check out the underground desert. Um, I'm gonna see if we have a pyramid. I hope we do, although I haven't come across one yet. We're gonna try to come across a pyramid. We'll play around with the fossils a little bit. Now, as you can see, I've already been down here once, but just like to poke around a little bit long enough to see what's down here. What? the fuck was that? Okay, that was new. Ooh, what's this? <coughs> Desert fossil. Oh, I hear that thing. Hear a worm coming, coming through the sand. Seen the sunshine since roughly about five minutes ago. I'm stuck in an underground desert, and time keeps dragging on. You gonna come attack me or what? Oh, just down there, I guess. It's a scared of me. Hey guys, look what I found. We have a chest. Wasn't exactly expecting to find cabins down here, but Extractinator. Turn silt slush fossils into something more useful. Hmm. I'll have to check that out when we go back. More bombs so I can blow more shit up. And recall potions. Alright guys, I did a fair amount of looking around and I haven't been able to find a pyramid. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna check out this extractor right quick. And then I think I'm going to go into my test world. Hopefully there's one there. So it said to place it. Oh. Okay, this is kind of cool. I'm basically just taking the fossils and I'm sort of placing them on top of the extractor and it's giving me ore and gold. A lot of gold. I want a sturdy fossil. All right, let's go see what we can get out of this. First we'll do the silt. We do, can't do dirt. Sand? Nope. Flush? Yes. A whole lot of ore. Safe to say I'm not gonna be mining much more until we hit art mode. That's the extractinator. Okay, so I think before we're done for today, I'm gonna hop into my test realm, see if I can find us a pyramid. I really hope we can because, you know, it'd be nice to see him. So I'll see you in a minute. 
and welcome back guys to my test realm basically the main reason why I have this is because one it's a large world so if there's anything that doesn't happen to spawn in our own we have this as sort of a backup also this is a expert world which means everything is a little harder, all the enemies are a little tougher, um, the bosses actually drop loot bags which give you additional gear and some items that you can't get in a normal world. I love these rocket boots so much. <laughs> and sweet hallelujah we have a pyramid. Drop a torch down, and I'm gonna start digging my way in here. So, pyramids like this, you can usually find them from the surface. Um, like, you'll see just the tip of them because they'll be buried in sand. And basically, once you manage to get in, there's gonna be sort of a zigzag path that we can follow, and there should be a chest at the bottom. got ourselves a little crypt in here. Nice little banners which I am definitely going to steal because I like them. So what do we got in here? Angry sandstorm in a bottle. Allows the holder to do an improved double jump. Is that better than... Hmm. We might have to see if we can find another shiny red balloon so that we can combine it with that. Yeah, so we got that. So that is a pyramid and it does keep going but I think there's only one chest. I'm gonna check anyway. But it just kind of keeps going down. Yeah, it just keeps going down. Until you hit your desert. Alright guys, so over in the other world, I went and found us another shiny red balloon. I combined it with the sandstorm and a bottle, and now we are going to test just how high we can jump. So here we go. One, two, three, and rocket boots. Yeah, that is currently our jump. anyway that is it for our desert adventures i hope you all have a fantastic day don't forget to like and subscribe leave me some comments down below and i'll see you next time bye